not the person like I used to be that was more open and social and not involved in both social activities. To be honest, not to be fear-mongering or pessimistic, it's just evident and in the face that the statistical outlook on the future for humanity or the probability of humanity to survive is extremely low. Basically, in short, there is no future, and it can be said that it's too late whether it one wishes to believe or not when looking at the destruction of life, the ecology of this planet. As you know, I estimated that within the next 29, 30 to 1 years, this planet would be a desolate rock going around the sun, confirmed by Hitachi, but soon forgotten and confirmed again with this death by 10,000 years of poison half life minus 4 magnitudes in 5 years equals death by 10,000 years of poison, whereas death by 10,000 years of poison half life minus 5 magnitudes in 10 years equals death by 10,000 years. If you are a human with an average lifespan anyway. Happy eating, everyone. Smile, children. You might live to see 25 after 15 years of accumulation. Don't forget to hug your elders for their gifts to you. Not only looking at the negligence of humanity and their environment, and the living things they supposed to share their existence with, the human nature of society and the ever-growing greed and segregation of people. Within a year I have observed a lot of negative change more than positive change. As you know the recession has affected the way people go on about their everyday lives, the majority, instead of uniting and working together to trash the monetary and currency system that fueled the greed and destruction of this planet, not the good happens. People I have observed have become more fascist in their ways. Three years ago, I could have a night out being antagonized. Now I get taunts, verbal abuse and threats just because I am different, where they feel they have every right to do this, from explicit discrimination tactics, to trying to break my apartment. This is not only in real life, online things are the same as well, for example, the removal of me from deviant art. I can look back and observe their stupid natures and throw a fuss in an all-out expression and protest, but it does not solve anything. It does not show people to see through the eyes of others and feel what it's like to be discriminated against and treated as an object of society because of being different. This has led me to step away from interacting with people in general and not developing them or even close friendship bonds since I have only observed them to be like plastic bands that snap at me causing more pain to reside away from the madness as if I am in the middle of a zombie apocalypse of stupid people who feed off the pain of others for their happiness. I do not even wish to reside continue my life on this planet knowing from gathered up data that there is no future and the people who created this no future do not wish to see it and murder countless innocent as well good people because of their choice of suicide for money. As you know I have mentioned that the only help you can get to fix up life and this planet is from the extraterrestrial people, the star people, who are historically known as the Elohim, who are not a specific race or group of people from a specific solar system, which people get this wrong all the time, because they rather follow others, instead of looking at the evidence and thinking and making sense of what they learn in. The thing is, the anti hate has gone well out of hand. Trying to push awareness about this for me has been a waste of time. Even though I am urged to press on, hoping that some small bit of insight would be the candle to light up the path of the truth. Then there are those people who believe it don't exist because of all the hoaxes and people who made money out of the suppression of the subject by authorities of government and industrial military complex. One of the things that make me sad is when people who know extraterrestrials exist and the details of the alternative energy solutions don't directly give people the tools and means to understand and get productive, but market ideas with money or books with information 
and the contact to the apps and ticketed and trade fee conferences that have not been perfected and are patented and copyrighted. The very poison that has killed the mother of Terra. Judd, whatever you wish to call this to gem in the solar system. It's like giving an artist some paint brushes and a canvas as a gift, but not providing the paint and telling them to make a work of art and be the change. Obviously, the artist is just going to sit there doing nothing and this is exactly what is happening. Because of money, and making money, and earning a living out of this situation which makes me sick, ill, and lose all hope completely to the point, I sit and think, why the fuck do I live on this planet? I am just like these things. You people dropped on Mars HTTP and Wikipedia or Wiki list of artificial objects on Mars sent. Use and dumped it's obvious. Because I have pleaded with my star friends and star mother, Ananania, to escort me away from this house. And still remain like these things. There were only data transfers, uploads, and downloads of information about my experiences and life on this planet. It's the harsh reality to realize this only to hope that I may be existing elsewhere without pain and suffering or my consciousness stored and retrieved to live a better life after this ordeal. Fortunately, I have been given a cat, and the cat has been a good friend to me.